Hi, my name is Venus O'Hara and welcome to another video. Please excuse the sound of the washing machine in the background. I've got to wash my clothes and uh, my, uh, my apartment's tiny. But speaking of sounds, this, this video is actually about sounds, about music. And many people over the years have asked me to make a video about music during sex or, to, or they've asked me for recommendations. What should we listen to during sex? So here it is, I'm making a video about music during sex. And I would make a, distinct, um, a distinction between music during sex and masturbation. For me, it sometimes can be different. And music during sex, for me, I think I like to have me relaxing music that, that, um, that has no lyrics. So for example, I like um, the type of music you would expect to hear in a spa or if you're having a massage. I'm going to leave a couple of um, links below in the description because there are a couple of channels here on YouTube that I always listen to when I'm in a kind of chill out mode. And they are channels that have binaural beats. And even though binaural beats is um, music, for example, that for example, in one ear you've got one frequency and in the other ear you've got another one and your brain creates this wave and, and in an ideal world you would wear headphones to create that effect. And these um, frequencies have different effects on the body and the mind. But I don't listen to binaural beats for those effects or benefits during sex, obviously, because during sex I'm kind of really present in the moment. And the sound of binaural beats is very pleasant. So there's lots of lots of um, music that you can um, find on, on YouTube as well. And also a lot of these um, these binaural beats, for example, they, they're very long. For example, you can find um, some videos of eight hours of music or three hours and other other um, keywords that I would recommend is meditation music as well because they tend to be long relaxing tracks. And I think it's important to have a long track because you can just let, lose track of time when you're having sex. You don't want to have an album that, that ends after 45 minutes or that you know the next song or the lyrics distract you. And I think lyrics can be very distracting and so can the rhythms, for example, something that's got a definite rhythm like pop music, house music, whatever. I think um, I wouldn't recommend that personally. For me, I remember one time I was with a guy and um, the radio was on and the radio is terrible because you never know what's gonna come next. You know, it's so unpredictable. It could be music and you could be listening to one song one minute and then it's another one. Especially if it's a song that you don't actually like, it could really distract you. But anyway, um, I remember I was with a guy once and the song that came on the radio was The Final Countdown. And I just thought, da -na -na, na -na 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 -na, the fine. And then I just realized that the thrusting was the same rhythm. And I, I got really, really distracted. Another time with the same guy, it was a guy I was with at uni, so there were no TVs, it was just radio. It was the World Cup. <laughs> and this is one of my worst ever stories. So listening to football commentary, how did I even let that happen? That's got to be the least sexiest thing, I think. But I think uh, we were gonna be separated at the end of the summer. I was gonna go to France and he was gonna go to London. So it was kind of, I was getting all I could basically. But one day it was, uh, yeah, the World Cup, and it wasn't even England playing, because if it was England, we would have been in the pub, of course. But anyway, so someone scored a goal of a country that wasn't England, another, another game. And then he just went, really fast to kind of kind of speed up and come and then he ran to, he got up off the bed and ran to the kitchen where there was a tv and his flatmates were there to watch the fucking action re oops, action replay i never swear on my youtube channel but i just had to do it and i was just there in the bed completely shocked so yeah i'm kind of traumatized by the radio and uh, the final countdown of football etc yeah, another thing I listen to when I am, um, another thing I would recommend as well as binaural beats, etc., is um, I list, I've got this app called Insight Timer that I'm using for meditation and it's so amazing. I've been using it for 50 days every single day. It's absolutely amazing. I really recommend it if you're into meditation. And also on this app, as well as meditation, they have thousands of meditations of all different styles. They also have music um, of very relaxing music and you can have nature sounds such as waves or even storms. I love that. I mean, just to be in bed and having wild sex and listening to some thunderstorm is just very, very, very erotic. Yes. And um, so for masturbation, um, I kind of listen to the same things because um, as you will know, if you're following my videos, I practice something called sexual transmutation or actually use I use my orgasm for manifestation. So every time I am on my own during masturbation. I set an intention for that particular orgasm and I'm really channeling all my thoughts towards it. 
and sometimes I would listen to binaural beats, but other times I might listen to affirmations. For example, there's another channel that I love called, I think it's called You Are Creators, and I'll leave a link below. And they have um, a video that's about affirmations for passive income. And I have several um, passive income um, programs set up. So it's, um, so it's wonderful to actually earn money while I sleep. And some of the affirmations that are, I have seven sources of passive income I'm like yes I do yes I do and then I earn money while I do what I love and I'm thinking yes I do I do <laughs> so I listen to that because I think affirmations are I, I, I love affirmations for programming the subconscious mind so I tend to listen to affirmations that are related to abundance so absolutely nothing to do with sex so I'm listening to, I've got my own thing going on in my mind and these affirmations are going in and it's really not sexy I think if someone heard it or, or watched me masturbating to affirmations then I think it would be a bit strange but I think it's working <laughs> so yeah so um, I would definitely recommend nature sounds in general storms binaural beats meditation music that's what I recommend because nothing is it's just kind of a background noise you know that doesn't doesn't distract from those moans and sighs that you really want to hear and orgasms Anyway, if you have any tips about what music you listen to or you should listen to or not listen to during sex, I would love to hear your comments in the comments section below. And if you have any suggestions for other videos, for new videos about orgasms, dating, sex toys, orgasmic living, then please don't hesitate to write to me at venus at venusohara.org or you can add me on Instagram at venusohara. Thanks for watching.